Hi, I'm Wheeler Winston Dixon, James Ryan, Professor of Film Studies at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln, and this is Frame by Frame. Digital cinema has become the only cinema. In the last few days, and this is Halloween 2011 as I say these words, Burns and Sawyer, which is the oldest Hollywood camera rental house in Los Angeles, just a few days ago, auctioned off all their film camera equipment. No one is shooting film anymore. This is a sad day for those of us who love film, but at the same time, one has to realize that this is just like the coming of talking pictures. It's a new platform and it has to be embraced. Uh, digital filmmaking requires more maintenance to preserve it. It costs about $20,000 a year to preserve a picture which is digitally born versus a film picture which you can just make a negative of and put into the ground and store it on a 35 fine grain negative. But the complete absence of all film cameras from film production, which is what is going on right now, is really a watershed moment. Uh, Burns and Sawyer, the manager of the company, said we'd like to keep the film cameras, but no one's renting them. There's just no point to it anymore. The ease of digital production, the ease of digital editing, and the fact, of course, that all theaters are shifting over to digital projection means the 35 millimeter film is headed for its final revolution and that the digital revolution has finally arrived.